Last year, I bought a four-in-one apple tree. I noticed a weird deformation on the bark in multiple places. Do you know what it can be and if it can be treated? And this is from Agnesca, San Jose, California, where you can grow a lot of your fruit trees. Four in one apple tree. But if you look at that picture, what I thought was, and, and I'll let you chime on this as well, Walter and Ms. Kim, I see that a lot. Those are actually little cells. Mm -hmm. And they're lentil cells. Lentil cells. Yeah, uh -huh. I you know, learned yeah. that in school. Lentil cells, which actually is there on a lot of your woody plants, Plant. mm -hmm. uh, on your bark. Uh, it's, it's the exchange of air between that plant and the atmosphere, yeah. right? So it actually happens right there at those cells, yeah. those lentil cells. Yeah. That's what those are. You, you and you see them on uh, cherry trees. It's cherry trees. You know, as well. Yes. Yeah. Right. So they're supposed to be there. <laughs> they're supposed to be there. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Right, right. So you want to add anything to that, Ms. Kim? Um, no, you don't need to treat it with anything. Right. So you're good. Yeah. 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 So yeah, it's supposed to be there. Again, it's yeah. the exchange of gases between the plant and the atmosphere. Yeah. I think that again, anything you want to add to that, Walter? No, that's like I said, you, you, want, you want that. Right, right. That, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. So there you have it. Agnesca, we appreciate that question. And yes, you want to have that. My biology teacher would be so proud of me right now. <laughs> I actually remember that from biology class. So how about that? Hope you enjoyed the video. We would love to get more questions from you. So be sure to leave us some comments.